Why, hello there. Welcome back to Paleo Pines. We call this game, How Long Has V Been Awake? About 25 minutes. <laughs> I'm so tired. We are... I don't know what we're doing today, to be honest. I've um, just moved a few days forward. Um, just for the sake of getting into the new season. Um, I've done all the ultra red checks the previous days. Nothing of note. But we're now into a new season so that we can... Well, enjoy Cretumnus, because Cretumnus comes with different seasonal spawns, as we all know by now, I'm sure. But also, it means I can get closer to the Triassia picnic, of which I'm not going to spoil to find out the surprise if it's going to be good or not. Because I like playing it by ear. And I'm hoping that when we stream next, I'll either get to the picnic or be just before that, so that the following stream will be picnic day. I guess we'll find out. Um, the idea is that <laughs> this is my 16th Paleo Pines video I'm recording in two days. I finished yesterday with 15 recorded in but a single day. Hey, it's polar. See, I don't see this outside of winter, which makes me think that maybe the Tyrannosaurus Rex version of that uh, skin is also locked to winter, but I could be wrong. Although it doesn't suggest that in anything I've seen so far. It's like, just based on the fact I don't see that Dimetrodon otherwise. Although that Dimetrodon might be locked, but the T-Rex might not be. Who knows? Um, I'm just wanting to know if I need to add it to the mega rare list. <laughs> I'm, uh, so yes, I'm, I'm recording, put five more Paleo Pines today, and then I'm recording five Minecraft Dinosaurs. Isn't that insane? Uh, there's no real objective for this episode, probably not for the next episode either. We're just going to just do some ultra rare hunting and just try and move time along so that we are closer and closer to the picnic, bit by bit. That's the aim and the objective at the very least. Whether we attain that, I don't know. <laughs> Um, of course, it is the end. Did I just go straight there, by the way? I can't remember checking. Oh, no, I did remember checking the Dinochirus uh, and Desmos the um, and the galleys because they were spawned over there. Uh, there was no real objective currently. We're not going to do quests and anything like that for this episode or the next episode. Just move time along, get close to the picnic, live happy. I picked up a load of uh, poop. Uh, the couple of days going game i say all of the poop actually so we don't have to worry about that for a few more days and then we will uh, it looks like the cherry trees have blossomed so i've got cherries now which could be problematic for um some dinosaurs i guess we'll find out if they start eating the cherries like idiots which they almost certainly will if the dinosaurs were smart actually no they wouldn't have survived the asteroid that that's that, you can't judge a species intelligence by its survivability of a literal death extinction event. That's on me. <laughs> I was about to say, they wouldn't have died out. Uh, they certainly would have. <laughs> I don't think they had any control in the matter. And the micro raptors, because it's raining, are over here. I'm still so shocked we managed to get a treasure micro raptor. That is, quite frankly, insane. We're up to 88 ultra rares now, with 12 more to go until we get to 100. Now, I will be honest, I don't think we'll hit that 100 by the end of next year, but we will most certainly in part way through the following year. I was hoping to have my Melanistic Trudon by 100. However, the likelihood of that has severely diminished. I would say to next to zero. <laughs> You consider there's what 40 something dinosaurs or 30 something dinosaurs and they themselves have I don't know four or five a piece so that's like 150 and then it's a 1000 chance of finding an ultra rare anyway yeah i don't like my odds chief Ah, <laughs> oh, dear me right silly f says no okay i'm um I'm starting to think that by the time all these videos go live, an update should have dropped. So creating such a big backlog could be problematic. But once again, we will do update videos. If there is an update, we'll do like a showcase video 
something to that effect so it's not the end of the world um i will absolutely have stuff prepped maybe oh can't forget the euplocephalus he's grass okay um so we do have that going for us i mean look if we get another update i'll do a showcase of all the new stuff and new things and then we'll continue on the series and i'll record it more <laughs> The plan for today is simply record five more of this, four after this, and then, oof, and then I get to uh, record some Minecraft dinosaurs. Then I need to, at some point tonight, edit every single one of these and render them It's a batch render. I'm hoping to do that today. Um, just so that we can get everything sorted. And if we don't, we'll do that at some point in the week. And it will just be an overnight jobby. And that will be interesting. Because it's going to be a lot of content. I mean, that's 25 episodes or 25 videos on top of my already existing six that are ready to go. But I haven't got like the thumbnails and stuff. I will then at some point need to start to work on every single one of these title, tags, description. You name it. And thumbnail. It's going to be a lot of fun. Like a few hours, like I'll have to sit down and just go through them all. It only takes a few minutes a piece, but it, it's going to be a lot. So I'm looking forward to uh, getting onto that because I'm probably just going to go, what are the episode titles first? Work out what was in the video, go from that. Oh, I forgot about the silly faces. Um, and after that, I'm going to go, okay, I've got the episode titles. Uh, and the descriptions let's work through the their order and just make a list of every single one of them on my phone which is what i usually do and then go okay i need a thumbnail of this 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 and it's just a case of just railing through <laughs> potential screenshots and thump for thumbnails and getting thumbnails ready so i would love absolutely love to be able to just look at my youtube studio app and go okay this is um my content sorted for a week uh for until june i would adore that also i've got a lot of cherries i've been picking up let's go to sleep um but yeah i i'm genuinely excited to just see that sort of graceful <laughs> time of relief and i'm like oh my god i'm there i've done it <laughs> I'm not giving plenty of time to like in the meantime just think about streams maybe more content if i can find another game that will just help bump that out as well it'll be nice and then also maybe updates and whatnot but getting a big like content backlog also allows me to do things like pick up overtime um go do things with my family go chill it's really nice can't complain it also gives me time to do other things like i've been enjoying miniature painting and building for a little bit now but i also want to go back to the gym properly because i've not been in a week and i'm like i need to go back to the gym but i need to get this all sorted first um and i'm not giving up on my hobby <laughs> so it's like this this is absolutely a hobby too that i want to just power through is that polar still i'm not sure yes it is um so once that's done, once I'm all caught up, I will 100% be enjoying myself on a good um, editing spree, rendering spree, and just chilling. Also, it's raining again. <laughs> oh, I forgot how much of a pain Cratumnus can be in terms of... You don't get to do much. <laughs> now, I might not be rich right now. In fact, I might be what we like to call on the business cash poor. But there is something I do bring to the table. I have t nearly 40,000 pieces of deluxe food waiting in my inventory. Waiting in my storage. Common. No, oh, I'm rare, sorry. Um, and um, that's that's nothing to shake a stick at. Considering that's 1.6 million when it comes to the um, carnivore kibble worth of food. And then the herb of all food is what 600,000 that's 2.2 million um shells worth of food that's that's kind of insane <laughs> 
Hey, I'm not going to complain. Also, I feel like I've... Oh, and I used some, so we had some already and so on and so forth, but... It, that's kind of... That's kind of insane. At the end of the day... Did I check the T-Rex? I think I did. I'll have to go double check him and test that T-Rex before we leave. And before we go to bed. Can't remember. I'm pretty sure I did. I'll check this one. I know I have checked this one now. So, there is that. Um, as for long episodes of Paleo Pines, once I've got this backlog finished, any further episodes I can record on the back of the backlog can 100% be longer episodes. There's no doubt in my mind. Um, it's just getting the... Uh, oh my god, that is really flooded. Getting the backlog built. It's always important. And for, clarifi for clarification, this video is probably not going live until, I assume, the end of May or midway through June. And all I'll say is from April the 21st, I hope you're having a great day. <laughs> Good lord. Hey, you know what? If, it, if I make it go live in June, then I can say that it's technically about the same release, like, period between each Lethal Company episode. <laughs> I can be like, yeah, no, look. <laughs> Two months after we played it. Right, I wanted to check the Desert T-Rex. That's why I keep hovering around here. Uh, so there is that. Okay, it was red. Perfect. I'll be honest. I'm expecting very few ultra rares this season. I think we've hit our yearly average. So I'm thinking maybe... Uh, maybe two or three. Um, also, have we done three days already? That's kind of crazy. Let's keep that sort of momentum up. Um, yeah, I'm thinking that we've hit our yearly average. So I'm thinking maybe one or two. Did I say three? I can't remember why I said three, but I don't know. Um, I'm thinking one or two. That's genuinely, I think, a healthy number. If we get two, that's awesome. We get up to 90. And then if I can absolutely smash next year and we get a 10. Oh, I'll be a very happy man. Um, so... We're into year 12. 13, we need, for my 7p average, I only need three more dinosaurs. Um, and if we get one from the picnic, that becomes two. So if we get any this year, that obviously just adds on to that. So if we got our one, then we'd only need two. And then one if we get them from the picnic. And if we get two this year and we get one from the picnic, we've hit that year average because 13 times by seven is 91. Nice and easy to remember. So, currently three away. I'm hoping within the next five episodes we get an ultra rare. Because ultra rares just make things a little bit more spicy. Just keep me going. Ah! But I am due a good drought. Trust me, I'm not um, so unaware of what I'm missing. <laughs> like, or what I'm expecting, sorry. Because I have 100% had some insane luck this year. This year's in game i think we have got over 10 ultra rares citation needed but i think that's the case um so we are due a good drought it, it's been insane so i can't remember if this is the year that i found the i think it's the same year i found the compi in the um two compies and then another day i've had two and eat two and two ultra rares in a day so to say that it's been a good year is an understatement because alone, I think, just... I think it's been about 10 ultra rares. I'm not even messing. Because the top of my head, I can think of seven. Wait, no, eight because of the picnic. Yeah, I think it's been... I think it's been a good year. So... That's kind of crazy. I do remember checking the T-Rex this time. Haha. <laughs> Partially because I was like, I need to remember to check it. <laughs> or I need to remember that I have checked it, I should say. We are powering through the days. I love this. Taking a nice pace and just being able to chat. Oof, beautiful. Because we're doing an ultra rare check, I might make it over 30 minutes. Hell, we might even make it 35 minutes. Just so I can power through the days. Imagine that. We'll see if I remember that by the end of the video. Okay, so no T-Rex today. That's fine. Oh, what day is it? Oh, one more day and we hit the fifth of Critumnus, which actually is kind of fun because the fifth of Critumnus gives us a load of small dinos. So we get an extra shot at a um, 
Black Cherry, um, the Honor Curse, and also obviously a Trudon. Just for free, which I love. What's the fourth one? Oh, back there. Uh, coffee. Gallimimus. No. No. <laughs> oh, Trudons. They only ever show up for my picnic when the picnic's broken. Fun fact, so do the T-Rexes. It's not the game hates me. Um, with a burning passion. Also, I'd like to highlight, the last time we did like an ultra-rare hunting stream with myself, Meerkat, and Tyrannos was the time I got a T-Rex. So I might have to do another stream with those two. Just so that I can get another T-Rex and hear Tyrannos seethe. <sighs> He'd be so disappointed in me. It would remind me of my childhood. And how everyone felt of me. A young prodigy that burnt himself out very quickly. Ah. Uh, I love it. Right. I know that we're probably going to have to do the problem children soon. How long can we last? I'm hoping we can get through a few more days. Because we've already got through... Effectively, we're on our fifth day. And it's 16 minutes. That's kind of crazy if you consider the fact I've kept the pace pretty damn consistent. <laughs> Wait, was that a higher synth? Yeah. Just making sure it wasn't an orchard. Because that would be an ultra rare. What's the second Wiro? There, Peach. The Wiro and the Stego are the two only dinosaurs in the entire game I have no ultra rare for. Which, within odds, that's actually kind of crazy because... I should be technically speaking like the odds don't prevent protect you from repeat dinosaurs um and i'm definitely thinking to myself that's actually really good only having two that were missing i could be wrong on the matter but i think that's pretty good where's the uplo there blue and where's that second dimetrodon there I saw this and I thought that was a Dimetrodon for some reason. It looks like a sponge. <laughs> so I'm very confused on how I made that mistake. But hey, I never said I was a smart man. Yeah, you'll never have that argument from me. <laughs> uh, especially the guy that didn't understand how picnics work the first year. Oh, uh, hey. Could you imagine that my first year's picnic was a melanistic Trodon and I just did not know? Woof Chief. You know what I'm curious about? Obviously you can't go back in time with the um, cheat command because it doesn't let you. I wish I could. Like just a bit of time travel shenanigans where I had all of my stuff and I could just go back and just see the first picnic, see what it was. And then tame it and then travel back in time, back in time to the future. Um, because that could be a lot of fun. Now, using the debug tool, I could absolutely spend an episode, and I'm not kidding here, mapping out the next 60 years in game of uh, picnics. And it could be quite funny. 100%. Did I go into the desert basin? Yes, I did. Right? Question? Ah, oh, I've already forgotten. Oh, I, this is the problem with just chatting parts. I forget things. <laughs> hey, fifth of Cretanus. Right. No, no, no. We're just missing the Archaeopteryx. Who's over there? And he's green. Cool. This is a very mint green Tyrannosaurus Rex. They're very nice. Right. We're going to go have a look. And we're going to have to go check back in the desert. I know that's going to mess with the... Um, averages but hey it's fine nothing's going to be in the basin because it is going to be well and truly flooded like that micro raptors noble honeysuckle where's the third one don't make me turn on super speed okay let's just have a look at the compies come back green cool now i will head back towards the desert check that basin i anticipate we might lose a dinosaur or two tomorrow i just don't know why i feel like the problem children are definitely going to strike right let's go check the basin because I, okay i'm starting to remember it i'm not gonna lie 
but I'd much rather be safe than sorry. Schrodinger shiny is a real thing. Uh, da, 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 da. Check the protos. Oh, okay, perfect. See, double checking is important sometimes. Especially if you like ramble like I do. Like, I don't gamble, but I might ramble. It's definitely a thing. I do. Also, green, pink, and pink. Yeah, the Triceratops. I still never get with the fact that I was waiting four years in game for a ultra rare tiller and I got like three at the same time. Kind of crazy. It's right in this diary. Keep playing. And I'll tell you what we're going to do next. I'm not going to believe this. <gasps> I go to sleep. Like clockwork. Oh, we got away with it. No complaints there. I wonder how many days I can get to. To be fair, it was done on the 20th. So 21st, 1st, 2nd, 3rd, 4th, 5th. So wait, 21st, 1st, 2nd, 3rd. 4th, 5th, 6th. So currently up to 7 days, so yeah, actually tomorrow I'm pretty sure it will be the problem children's time. It usually is around this time. Also, just need to move the microphone slightly. There we go. So, that's not too bad. Also, if we have a look, I have 54 dinosaurs on the ranch. 34 ultra rares with um, Mary. No, not 34. I, I don't remember. Um, 37, actually, because we've got 30, 51 ultra rares, and then obviously we go up to 88 to 37. Wow. Mary's a champ. <laughs> Mary's house must smell like absolute dino caca. That's fantastic. Um, but yeah, we'll, we'll hopefully, fingers crossed, find an ultra rare soon. As I said, at most, I think two this season. Realistically, one or none. <laughs> we've had we've had some good luck. I, I think I'm due a good drought. You know, it, it's been a long, a long time coming, but 13 years nearly in this game. Obviously, not IRL. That'd be crazy. That'd be my Minecraft. <laughs> I've spent so many years in Minecraft. No skelly spawn over here, so I don't know why I'm checking. But I'll remember that I did that, and that will help me remember that I did check the basin. Check the T-Rex, check the basin. Oh, postos. Green and orange. Interesting. Fascinating, almost. Nope. That coffee one made me double check, and once again, that guy. Oh, okay. It's sunny today, but it has been raining, and remember... The flooded basin seems to be like um, a big thing for the Trudons a lot during Triassia and a lot during Cretumnus. It is indeed a bit of a pain in the bootay. Right, so for context, I started with a 1.3 terabyte free hard, not hard drive, NVMe, but 1.3 terabytes free. And currently we have 950 gigabytes. I have 350 gigabytes of 4K footage from the last couple of days. That is insane. So I was just looking at my other monitor at action, my recording software, and it was just like, oh yeah, I see that number going down. That's kind of hilarious. Um, so yeah, I think this backlog so far genuinely has gone exceptionally well. We're recording 15 in a day is definitely a new record for me. Um... Considering, you know, bar two episodes, they were all like 30 minutes long as well. I'm really proud of what I was able to do. It's kind of crazy. If you think about it. Um, oh, it's not flooded. But we are disappointed with a cherry and a coffee. And up here, a wisteria and that dreaded light blue. Compies are a no. Right. If I had to wager, we're going to lose one or two dinosaurs tomorrow. If I had to wager, that is. We'll see if I'm wrong or right, though. Okay, oh, pick up those cherries. 
Not that make up too much of a difference to me. It's just, to be fair, what are they? I'm assuming juicy and fragrant. Yeah. That's pretty good to have on hand. Let's go to sleep. How many do we reckon? One or two? One or two? One or two? We'll do the problem, children, if that's the case. And then we'll squeeze one more day in afterwards. Oh, just one. So we're not going to do the problem, children. We'll do um, Umbra Raptor. He's all the way over here. Because these Utah, Utah Raptors are. Are you Umbra Raptor? You are. Um, and these Utah Raptors are genuinely a pain. Like they're, they're always like this. But like the other one, the Raptee, will 100% probably be in the same boat before long so we'll definitely do a problem child cleanup at the end of the day um but i might do that off camera uh so that's fine let's just wrap up a final day and um after that we'll see if uh <laughs> we'll do another episode of just pretty much doing a hunt like this because we have moved forwards well past the three-day average that was like how many days has it been? Around, by the time this ends, seven days, give or take. Well, six days, really, for all in all. But that's decent. And if we can do that again, oh, we'll be laughing. We'll be absolutely laughing because I will then be able to go, okay. I've got, what, after this, this is episode 16. So after that one, it'll be three more episodes to make a month and five days but if i can at least get closer to the picnic once again absolutely golden so yeah we'll take it as it comes or i could just be an absolute champ and try and power through as much as possible in this episode the problem is i want a drink and a vape and just to wake up a bit more <laughs> so i might take a break very quickly i know there's only one episode in but uh, breaks are important especially when you need them yesterday i didn't actually feel like i needed a break for quite some time i powered through i felt great for it today i'm like ah oh, i need a break i want to have a you know a little bit of caffeine and nicotine why have you been there like three days in a row now chief i'm pretty sure it's supposed to be a rare very confused by that legitimately Confuddling. Okay, I just want to double check. Cool. I have definitely checked the T-Rex and the Utahs are... No. Or... Uh, maybe we'll make it a little bit longer. <gasps> I know. Obviously, I'll need to do the problem children because I'm probably going to lose another one tomorrow, but that's fine. Absolutely fine. Um... And then we'll do the problem children and then if i feel like another day we'll do another day if i don't we'll just call the episode it's not in the world there one two no because just doing those problem children will help extend the time a little bit longer as well which is fine and will also mean that i don't have to clean the poop again until the end of next episode i would imagine and then we're golden um, but hey, what have we got up here? Nothing. Nike Raptors will be here because it's not raining today. Three, four, no. Galleys and no. Oh, it's not flooded down there. I think our third day. Uh, no. Dagnamit. Two cream compies. I wonder if, um, because now we've got the colourful pride. We've got the melanistic, got the albinistic. I just think my compi luck went from zero to a 100,000 billion very quickly. I, I I just don't understand it personally. So many in there I just can't reach. <laughs> I should have like left one open as like a small gateway. But it's fine. How many dinosaurs are we losing? I didn't press the button <laughs> oopsie poopsie oh hello okay that's great 
no complaints from me that actually gives us a whole day before that's kind of crazy because if we do the maths again so 21st is uh when i did it so one two three four five six well yeah um oh no no because i did it on the 20th so yeah we've gone about eight days now uh obviously we have one on the seventh day which was just one of the problem children which is still a marked improvement so i'm not complaining and then we'll um do the rest of the problem children today and we'll continue on our merry way two three no one two no can't say i've um seen an ultra rare parasaur recently it's been a while we are overdue one in my books absolutely overdue one because i do love the melanistic but a birch um parasol would be amazing just saying and now we zippity zippity zoom by see the storm mallow because it is actually in fact not just raining it's storming today the velociraptors are not there so there's hop that means p yellow <laughs> wait a second that's not like a that's not a, i think that's is that a rare i gotta remember remind myself what is in the um serato's ultra rare and rares uh the carno serato here perfect no the yellows are common interesting huh never would have guessed it i think i have like i think they have like six ultra rares the um serato and i think i've got like four of them melanistic albinistic uh i've got the marzipan and i think there's one other i've got i could be wrong on the matter there's a lot of the dinosaurs i've got a complete collection for or in some cases a nearly complete collection for others i've only got one and others i've got zero ultra rares isn't that crazy isn't that crazy the trudel's got like four different ultra rares and it has a pretty reasonable spawn in comparison to say i don't know t-rex megalosaurus so on and so forth and yet i've only got one of them malarkey i tell thee malarkey atlas and sunflower two that should have been not ultra rare but alas they are not wait a second is atlas on the stegosaurus is it so i'm just checking on an image stegosaurus 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 uh there we go no it is a rare malarkey hang on what color was that yellow pink and bluish bluish very much related to blue just ish <laughs> up here we have two of you guys it's raining no microraptors one two three four where's the galley there he is nice and green uh two different types of light blue microraptors peach honeysuckle noble and two salaries right i think we go back and start doing the problem children and we'll go from there in the next video we'll pretty much do this again and hope that we get a little bit better luck but a drought is a drought right let's begin good lord i, I somehow walked forwards uh how much do you want to crap guys because i'm gonna say it was a lot another one another one another one another one and you guys okay this isn't unreasonable so far he says he was wrong he's noticing actually four is not horrific so far is there a fifth 
No. Okay, that was actually pretty reasonable, guys. I'll let you off. Um, so Crow and Truman, that lot, they are um, proud of Fury. They are 100% not an issue. These guys definitely are. Specifically Lucky. And Tricon Occasion, actually. So, definitely a problem job. And we'll go over this way. So, these guys have become one because they crap so much that it gets to, like, their limit, effectively, pretty early. Although, by picking up one poop, it went the badonk noise, which means they probably were not too close to their limit just yet. But, eh. Better safe than sorry. Especially with these guys. A lot of the solo dinosaurs that, like, living on their own absolutely have no issue with the amount of poop they crap uh very rarely tyrannophant will be in that situation i've not seen it happen to Baryodus or the others yet so like the dimetrodons for example they're absolutely fine what a great pen thank you these guys will absolutely do just to be safe because once again it's just a case of okay they yeah they weren't close to their limit not at all Oh, still dirty, though. Missed. Can't see any more. Uh, these guys will be fine. Once again, solos don't really have too much of an issue. I will check up on... Um... Oh, you've got two, which means you are nearing your limit, so I will just uh, extend it slightly. You're welcome. Uh, not yourself, you're not a problem. Just by walking in, made your car no happy, which is kind of crazy. And just by walking in here, I made you guys happy. But that's because I recently cleaned this up. Oh, there's three of them in here. Walking in, made them happy. I didn't actually need to pick up that poop. Okay, funny as hell. They have got a larger enclosure, though, I think. I'm not too sure on that. Uh, you're all right. You guys won't be. And then i got to do Ginger Mimus and that lot, actually. I forgot about them. And Sidious and Grievous, because they've got three in there now, and it's a pretty small enclosure. And they do remind me that. Oh, wow, there's a stinky right next to the food. You I mean, really need to go over your eating habits. <sighs> and eating, crapping where you eat. Right. Let's go over here. Nice and easy, does it? Just get all of these. Oh, for God's sake. Go. Is that all of your biscuits you've left for me? Yep, 100%. Did I already do these guys? No, I did not. Wow. <laughs> it's the game of crap around the tree, is it? So you can leave the most. Is that all of it? No, just one more. Huzzah. Right, how much poop did we accrue? Uh, enough. Right, write in diary. Keep playing, go to sleep. I tell you what. If we don't lose any more dinosaurs and I didn't miss a problem child, we'll 100% keep going. There we go. Right, 17 dinosaurs need attention. That's technically not true. They should get my attention. They're not, because means I have to feed into playing with the crap crap system. Um, so, there is that. Um, right, one, two, three. Where's the fourth one? There. Okay. Oh, I could do with more sleep, couldn't I? Probably. Uh, over here's a no. I'm thinking that over the next few days, IRL, I'm going to get a lot of warm. <laughs> we'll see if that's the case. I actually need to finish some models, like finish, finish. I've got a couple that are like 90% done, so I just need to like add some tufts of grass to the ones up here. 
if I can get them all into the same state, then I can just go, okay, cool. Let's just fully finish them. Um, and I will be very happy when that's the case because I'll have an actual usable army kit. That'll be nice. No. Also, I uh, ordered a bunch of magnets. I did not realize how tiny the magnets would be. <laughs> Oops. Oopsie poopsie. I mean, they're going to have a purpose, absolutely. Not the purpose we thought they'd be. Because, my God, are they tiny. So I need to find out what size magnets I need for my town. And then order them, respectively. <laughs> Oops. Oh, dear me. I'll probably order them alongside when we get the, like, the shaper or something. Not the shape of the um, lone spear. Until then, I will not be placing the weapons on my tower because I need to magnetize them. On my crisis suits, that is. Because I'd like to be able to rock. I've got nine crisis suits total and I'd like to be able to rock either all of one type, two of one type, one of one type, and then or one of all three types and just see which one I like the most um, and then go from there. So I 100% need to magnetize. Um, it also means making a load of bunch of weapons, which could be painful, but hey, I've got a load of fusion blasters. <laughs> I'm not kidding. Right. Nothing on this front. I can't remember checking the T-Rexes. Any of them. Desert or this one. Sigh. <laughs> I definitely went into autopilot mode for the last minute or two. That's kind of crazy. That is definitely crazy because I just checked it again and I'm not... Wow, I really need to wake up. Good lord. Yes, red. I even thought it was red. I just couldn't acknowledge it. Go off. Right. It's better safe than sorry though. Trust me. And for those going, oh, that's silly advice. It was grey. I, I could see that. Ah, right. Let's go check out the T-Rex. New day. I want to see... Nah, we'll end the video after this one day, I think, because I really need to just take a moment. And wakey freaking wakey. Because good lord. Right, let's get out there and into here. Save the day. And we'll go to a new day. If you have enjoyed today's video, please make sure you just smash the like button down below. If you haven't haven't already please make sure to subscribe and join my crazy vacations it's super duper appreciates thank you all so much for watching have a nice day and ta -ra.